Yo guys, what's up? Checking out Age of Mythology before it's a uh, retold remaster that's coming at some time. Release date still unknown. It's on discount right now, anyway, until the 13th of February. Uh, I don't remember ever having played this game before. It came out in 2002 and it's a very beloved game uh, for people with 30,000 reviews on Steam. A lot of people ask me if I'm going to be playing this, uh, if I'll check it out sometime or if I have played it. And I'm taking a little break from Dota 2 and League, so I thought it's a perfect chance to check it out right now. Uh, let's start by watching the opening cinematic, and then I'm going to just start a sandbox random map. A lot of people in chat are telling me the campaign is great. I may check it out later, but first I want to go and jump in a random map to kind of see what the gameplay is like. And in an RTS, I'm generally a tutorial skipper. I like to figure things out for myself, but let's check out the cinematic. Uh, AOM cinematic. Can you guys see it? Because something happened to my resolution. You guys can't see it, right? Okay, let's try again. Something happened to my resolution and every window in my dashboard resized. So how about we don't check it in game? We simply... Something weird happened. Yeah, I think I will just check it on YouTube. Age of Mythology. That's why the retold is coming, right? Uh, cinematic. Here we go. It's from 2002. Same year Warcraft 3 came out, which is probably why I never played it. It looks pretty good for that time. It was a vision. I guess they got some kind of buff boost from their god. Sound design not as good as Blizzard. But it's cute. Ghost appeared for like a second. Alright, cool. Let's go to the game. Single player, random map. So it seems like the equivalent of picking like a race or a faction is like um, mm, picking a god. You can choose one of the random gods from one of these factions. Uh, the DLC is gating Fu, Shi, Nua, and Shenong. And we can pick from Greek, Egyptian, Norse, and Atlantean. And then each one has three different gods. Let's go ahead and go with um, Poseidon. Always like Poseidon. Poseidon, uh, focus on cavalry, buildings, produce, militia when raised. Responding hippocampus at docks helps scout the sea. Market trade is cheaper. Cavalry and stables are cheaper. And then... We've got uh, four ages, okay. I wonder how similar is Age of Mythology to Age of Empires 2 or 4? Uh, probably quite similar, right? But in a mythological age rather than a historical uh, age. 
It's it's kind of like four. Hmm, kind of similar. Closer to four than two. Okay, I really like Age of Empires four, so I'll probably like mythology too. So you've got four ages, the Archaic, Classical and Heroic Age and Mythic Age. And I guess these are new units. Oh, I guess it's like choosing a landmark in Age of Empires 4. When you advance to the Classical Age, you do so either via Ares or Hermes. Or by getting to Classical Age, you can then unlock Ares or Hermes, one of those. So either way, you make a choice probably between these. I don't know if it's the former or the latter. Uh, lure a target target a location for a special stone which draws animals towards it after summoning a certain amount of animals the lure will crumble so like pokemon go incense pegasus food and mana storm mana god mana something like that i guess takes one man woman myth unit flying scout has no attack can only be attacked by ranged units favor i see favor there's a short cinematic. Oh, yeah. Uh, Hippocampus, Poseidon's naval scout. Has no attack, but responds when killed. And then if you get to classical, tier 2. God of battle and slaughter. Improvements target attacks. Uh, target attacks of human soldiers. Target near enemy military buildings to prevent them from training in the new military units. Pestilence. And you get the Cyclops, which I always think is badass. Cost food, favor, and four population. Myth unit, giants that hurl enemy units at other enemy units. That's cool. That's really cool. Ceasefire from uh, Hermes, God of Messengers, Cavalry. Ceasefire, target anywhere on the map to prevent every player from fighting and building towers or fortresses for a short period of time. Kind of tactical. Cool so far. Centaur, 200 stone? Wood? Wood. 200 wood. Uh, 12 favor and 3 population myth unit a fast moving cavalry archer with an accurate shot special attack okay hold up a second excuse me accurate in aoe 4 and starcraft and warcraft you can't miss but in age of empires 2 you can there is no talking about accuracy now i'm thinking maybe you can miss in this game i'm curious as to how the skill expression for that is you can miss damn all right well we'll find out uh, i've chosen my god i familiarized myself with the start i keep everything else in uh standard mode but i'll go to uh yeah let's keep supremacy on multiple win conditions we'll go to large map easy ai let's begin we're on ghost lake all right Little bit loud, maybe. It's better now. I dropped the volume. <laughs> the best offense is a good defense. He invoked lure. How do I do lure? This one? Here. Is that lure? Alright, come on, animals. Hey, I start with towers. That's funny. Let's see, I have eight food gatherers. I'm 10 out of 15 pop. How do I build? How do I make population? House, E. Okay. It looks like there are hexes in this game, but, uh, oh no, they're... Where's my animals? My lure isn't working. <laughs> My lure isn't working. Or is it? Is that why there's a deer here? Maybe it is working. There is no grid for buildings. Yeah. That's that's wild. Look at this. Like you can snap away from trees, but there's no actual grid. So you can have infinitesimally small differences 
in uh, in where you build. That's crazy. Can I click the dead body of the... I don't think I can. Oh, there it is. There's deer here. Okay, I can click it. Caribou. Uh, 100 food. And this one. I wonder if there's food decay. Let me see. Yeah, there's food decay. So it's like AOE 4 then. Let's start cutting trees. Can I can I chase a deer home like an AOE 4? No, they completely ignore me. <laughs> Just like I've had worse. You're hitting me? I've had worse. Oh, I can control goats. Yo, polar bear. No, don't run away. Okay, just surprise him. Then he can't run. Oh, they went right in. What's the eject half key? Oops. Oh, they don't show the hotkeys when you hover over something, so I'm gonna have to try. Okay, I'm keen to guess. That's okay. Ah, N. It's N. Let's see, will the sheep get home by themselves? Yes. Uh, this is actually the reason in RTSs that developers implement a audio repeat delay for acknowledgements. A small delay goes a long way. Probably put myself here so you can see the resources. Okay, let's get gold too. Oops. Oh, okay. I now see that I don't actually want this setting. That I'm automatically garrisons. Because I want to return resources. Pretty nice music. Yeah. Play me that... Play me that violin harp thing. We spawn really close to each other. Wait, 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 hold on a second. Don't tell me that this is a neutral non-player controlled settlement that you can take over. Oh my god. An abandoned or unclaimed village. Build a town center on top of a settlement to claim it. Oh my god. Okay, I won't tell you. That's okay, somebody else did. Empty me. Oh, we need more gold. He said, don't tell me, Chad. Yeah. Eptimos. What's this? Berry bush. Oh my god, berry bush. Uh, what is middle mouse button? It seems like middle mouse button is recent transmission storehouse drop site for wood and gold can you power build in this game yes you can it looks like you can drop off resources but you don't have visual display that you drop off resources. It also feels like this is built too close. Can you delete this? Oh! <laughs> wow! I feel like back in the old days, people gave you more responsibility than these days. In the old days, if you press delete, it immediately destroys your building. <laughs> but in AoE four times, they're like, hold delete for three seconds to delete it which i feel is just like holding your hand 
and trying to protect you. And I don't want government oversight. Are you sure? Hold this for three seconds, but that just feels undynamic. Why can't I build this? It's red. I bet you need to be tier two, just like in AOE. So we're gonna build a temple, and then we're gonna go tier two, and then we can expand. I bet that's it. Don't tell me though. Need to advance. Damn it! Damn it, chat. I need backseating on many games, but RTS, I'm keen to explore. F you, I won't do what you tell me. Hmm. I may need backseating on Hades and and whatnot. But this is RTS. This is my jam. Ah, you choose what to age up with. Okay. Oh. And what's this then? Wait, am I immediately age up? Oh, the age up happens in isolation from your main base's uh, occupation. Like you can keep making villagers. Oh, no, no, no. Never mind. I see it now. <laughs> it's both tabulated on top as well as in the production queue. I see. I see. You can read the exact upgrades. Yeah, yeah, I read it before I started the game. His improvements target attack of human soldiers. Wouldn't be an age game now if that was possible. Who's your favorite age of mythology player from the past? Yeah, that's, that's the question to ask a first time player. I want to see how multi-building works. Okay, I see. The same essentially as in uh, AOE 4. Uh, the command queue doesn't work as I expect. When I press stop, they want to build stables. Because you are automatically in the building menu. That's wild. If I click a villager, I'm in the building menu. Immediately. I don't have attack move, stop, hold. Let's try to figure it out. Player options. Mm. Player options. Where are the hotkeys? Surely you can change the hotkeys. Where can you? Maybe you can't. It's in a file. Oh, you can, but not in game. It's great. Uh... Oh, is it profiles? I know I didn't do anything yet, but so far I like the game. I guess I just like RTSs. What are they building? Oh, they're praying. <laughs> Wait, is that what gives favor? I guess that gives favor. Villagers generating favor equals seven. Click to send tribute to That's so funny. It's an actual resource. So you can't just build town centers anywhere. Oh, you can rotate. Hmm, interesting. Is there any point to rotating? Aesthetics. Kirby likes RTSs, who knew? It's a daring gamble, but if you did gamble on it, you'd be right now. Aesthetics, yeah. There's no hotkey here. Or is there? Oh, H is main base. <laughs> There's no hotkey to upgrade these. Hey. Oh, relics. The, myth the mithril horseshoes. Garrison this relic to gain his. Oh my god, I thought AoE 4 was the first to think of relics. Now I find out AoE 2 and Age of Mythology have done it before them. There's no hotkey for this. We just have to click things.
you can bind them. I just pressed Q, W, E, R, T, etc. all the way till M. And then I press 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Read relics. Well. Set diplomacy. Yo, ally end. Ally at end. Share win. Tribute resources. Food, please. Okay. All right. Shall we check out the campaign? You guys said it was pretty good. Let's check it out. Uh, I like the game so far. I like real RTSs for real men and real women and unreal men and women. Recently, there have been a lot of RTSs that have dumbed down mechanics that make it an uh, easier barrier to entry. Not for me. Wow, Grubby lost? No, I, I was leading. I just gave him the win out of uh, leniency. Campaign. Learn to play. Fall of the Trident. Golden Gift. New Atlantis. Load scenario. Let's start with the fall of the trident. Learn to play? Nah, I'm a tutorial skipper. Easy, moderate, hard titan. Let's go moderate. Is Atlantis the land that sank? And that's why it's not real anymore. Atlantis, Georgia. <laughs> it has been a long time since you sent him to the underworld, Arkantos. Fighting old battles again? Yes. Old enemies. I still see them here. You have won more battles for Atlantis than can be counted. Faced opponents no other man dared fight. That was long ago. Today, Atlantis' enemies live only in my dreams. I face feeble pirates now. Is that what you believe, Atlantean? Yes. Atlantis still has enemies. Oh. And you are still the one who will face them. Me? Any who threaten my home or my family will soon have a place in my dreams. That These shows are he has enemies a unlike the others, Arkantos. Do not let your guard down. Dark times are coming. It and shows you he has a conscience. Arkantos, awaken. After he kills them, he dreams Admiral, of them. Sir, yes? We've or sighted land on the horizon. We should reach Atlantis soon. Excellent. It will be good to see my son Castor again. Cool. Not a bad intro. Nice music. Have you played Rise and You Fall? cannot ignore the omens, Arkantos. I think yes. Lord Poseidon's displeasure is clear. We must help break the siege at Troy. Troops we send now will be lucky to arrive before the fight is over. Even if they do, their only task will be to show the banner of Atlantis, not a task for an admiral. It would shame Agamemnon if we sent one of your junior officers. He already complains that we do not pay enough attention to the Greek colonies. No. It must be you. What in the name of... Castor, stay here! Wait... I've seen this on someone's stream or YouTube. Get those Patroboli up here. I actually remember this mission, not from playing it, the but... Atlantean but, army is on the way. but someone Defend else's stream. Until they arrive. That was me? No, I don't think it was you. Ah! <laughs> Arcantos is a hero, and very effective at killing myth units such as the Kraken. Hold on, hold on. I, uh... I have a bug. Pause. Play in window. Look, I don't know why... Oh, I see, I see. When I set default hotkey settings, it defaulted everything, including my volume, my sound, my music, my shadow quality, VSync. <laughs> I don't think it should reset everything when you're defaulting in uh, in hotkeys. But okay, fair enough. They did say everything. <laughs> uh, my bad, I guess. 
Uh, that's 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 a user error. I suppose. Grudgingly, I admit it. It's almost like it doesn't hold your hand. Yeah, no kidding. Exactly. I thought you said well, you like no hand holding. That's why it was so loud. Oh, it's because I made a new profile. Oh, okay, I see. That makes sense. And it didn't duplicate the default profile into the new one. It started over. That's fair. Shadow details only medium. Do you think uh, I can handle highest? All right. What's this? Hoplite. Where's my... Where's my... Okay. Make some villagers. How much resources have I got? Population. Okay. Black sails. A landing party. Is there a attack move? Yeah. But there's repeat delay. So say for instance, I click A and then left click. They're gonna A move in that direction, which is good. But if I do A click multiple times, it deselects my army because I'm essentially left clicking. I'm left clicking the black sails are going to on ground, which is a deselect. So I'm like one, A, left click, A, left click. It's okay, A, left click. But when I do it fast, it deselects. It's an old game. out of a particular resource, you should consider retasking them to gather it. Okay. It's an old game. I can uh, forgive them. Storehouse. You want to create a little gap, otherwise they can't walk around it. They create a really large gap. You see how far away? Your game is running at 1.5 times speed. You must set frame limit. I mean, that sounds like a good thing. Wait, more frames, the game runs faster? But isn't that nice? Higher, higher speed? Where, where do I cap it anyway? I feel like... Running fast is okay for me. Doesn't really bother me. Hoplite P. Alt S. Alt H. Nice music. <laughs> He's throwing. <laughs> nice. Nice physics. The game isn't faster, it's just a timer. Prostagma. Good work, but keep your eyes open. Isn't the game campaign just played on faster mode in general? Maybe. There's a green icon on production building that lets you create them constantly. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Arcantos. Do not forget to call upon your god powers. Your god powers are located in the top center of the screen. Oh. Use the rain god power to help your farms produce more food. Oh, okay, cool. That's pretty neat. Another Kraken headed for the shore. Release the Kraken. Can you attack your own buildings? Let's see. A landing party! Oh, you can't. Interesting. That's probably a, a noob-friendly thing to do. Attacks from buildings can hit moving targets easier. Towers do more damage to cavalry. You can just press delete. Yeah, yeah I know. I know that you can. I just wondered whether you could attack your own buildings. You know, if you ask me now, I wouldn't know if you could target your own buildings in Age of Empires 4. I feel like maybe also cannot. Excellent. Get ready, everyone. This isn't over yet. So if I click this, it's just gonna keep making villagers. Consider upgrading oh. weapons and armor. 
Interesting. And right-clicking opens an inf uh, info screen on them. It repeats the four villagers you made. Yeah, infinitely. So it's essentially repeating the one in production while always keeping a queue of three because it will never deplete it because it knows that it should have one in production and three behind it. Interesting. Of your units at the armory. It. I'm pretty much ignoring what she's saying. Oops. Storehouse. <sighs> Military academy, archery range, watchtower, farm. F. How many main bases have we got? One. Can we go tier two? Cannot. Prostagma. Black sails, pirates. Oh, F8 is quick save. Always have your catapults in the front, guys. Game of Thrones, season eight tactics. Switch to combat commands. I I still don't know how I can make units stop. Let me test. Huh? It's Q, apparently. It's not H or S. Huh. Q. Okay. Interesting. Another Kraken approaching! Pray this is the last! Yeah, soundtrack is good. A black sail landing party! I feel like music is more important for player acquisition than gameplay. Gameplay keeps you there, music gets you there. I see. It's roughly the same control scheme via UI as Age of Empires 4. So it's kind of a clicker game because you uh there's no hotkeys for some of those as far as i can tell anyway oh oh i see oh what <laughs> okay tab is open the map uh, I wonder how I can toggle between these two, you know? It's not tab. Normally, you use tab in other RTS to toggle between these two. But I think this game expects you to remember the hotkeys for barracks. So something like Control S or Alt S or something. Let's say, what's this called? Archery range. Alt A. Control A. Oh, it's Control A. And then this is a uh, military academy, so I guess Control M. No, M is storehouse. Maybe it's whatever you build it with. Oh my God! Help! Did we just lose? <laughs> oh, thank you. Hyperspace. Control A. Ah, it's Control A for archery. Oh, yeah, we knew that. So, how do you build a military academy? B. So, I guess Control B. Yes! I figured it out. Build more houses. You cannot build another house, really? Thomas, 
Πρόσεχε. Πρόσταγμα. Έστω. Έστω. Μάλιστα. Πρόσεχε. Έστω. Έστω. Έτοιμος. Ρητόμος. Έτοιμος. Oh. Why not? Because I'm max. Total population cap 95. Click to send tribute to your allies. Huh. It gave me a lot of free units. It doesn't want me to lose. I think it's a scenario cap. Okay, what was the quest again? Oh, we won. <laughs> All right, let's go. You can only have 10 houses. Yeah. We won. You did awesome. Yeah. I know. Another message from Poseidon Arcantos. His creatures help the pirates. Father, they stole the trident. Fun grub fact. What? This level was built yes. in a way that it the was stolen during the fighting. <laughs> no, I can tell. There could not be a clearer sign, Arcantos. We are losing Poseidon's favor. We must act. I will go to Troy as you ask. I'm going to get that trident back on the way. Zathos! Take supplies aboard and get the men together. We're setting sail. Can I come? No, I need you here in case they come back. <laughs> Don't worry. This errand will not hey, take you man. Off. Uh, thanks for the raid, Count Von Count. Continue your journey. Next scenario campaign menu. Well, that was kind of easy. I think I'm going to increase things to hard. Next scenario. Let's go.